Welcome to Elaine Medical Library Tutorial. In today's video, you will learn how to avoid hitting paywalls by using our DocExpress document delivery service, a mostly free service from Lane Library. After watching this tutorial, you'll know when to use DocExpress, how to make a request for full text, and what you can expect when using the service. Have you ever come across an article with no full text or PDF available through Lane Library or openly on the web? Or maybe you need an article that's only available in print at Lane Library, but you are unable to visit our library space. Or you need an entire book that's not part of our library collections. DocExpress can help. With DocExpress, Lane Library will get you access to these materials. We will obtain digital copies of articles, scan articles we only have available in print, and borrow physical books from other libraries on your behalf. You can use DocExpress if you are a student, faculty, or staff member at Stanford's School of Medicine, a staff member at Stanford Hospital and Clinics, or Lucille Packard Children's Hospital, a student in a Stanford Bioengineering or BioX program, or a Stanford undergraduate student in a Hume Bio major. And the majority of services are free of charge. You will only be charged if you make duplicate requests for the same materials or have large scanning requests. To get started, you need to create a DocExpress account. Your DocExpress account is separate from your SUNET ID or hospital ID. Visit our library website at lane.stanford.edu and navigate to DocExpress document delivery service under the services menu. On the DocExpress homepage, select first time user, create an account under the login option. Read our copyright statement and follow the prompts to create your account. You must use a Stanford affiliated email address for your account. Once you have an account, you can begin making requests. There are two common ways to make a request. Option one, through the Find It at Stanford page that appears as you navigate through Lane Library's resource links. And option two, directly through the DocExpress request page. Let's take a look at both options. You'll likely request materials through the Find It at Stanford page. As you search through Lane Library or databases you access through our website, occasionally you'll encounter articles with no full text available. When that happens, you'll see the Find It at Stanford page with the message, no direct link to full text available. In this case, you can try searching for the article on Google or Google Scholar to see if it's freely available somewhere online. If not, select the DocExpress document delivery service link to be directed to the DocExpress login page. Log in with your DocExpress account. Remember, this is not tied to your SUNET or hospital IDs. You can create an account if you have not already or update your password if you no longer remember it. After logging in, you'll be taken automatically to the article request page. Many of the fields in the article request form will be pre-populated with information from the Find It at Stanford page. Check the information and fill in any missing details. After the form is complete, select Submit and know that your article will be on its way to your inbox soon. Another option for making DocExpress requests is to go to the DocExpress homepage directly through our website. After logging in, you can select the material you are requesting under New Request. On the Article Request page, enter the DOI or PubMed ID at the top of the page to ensure we don't have immediate access. After you make a request, you'll be able to see your pending requests in DocExpress. Most requests take one to two business days to process. The turnaround time for print books is longer due to the need to transport physical materials. 
When your Doc Express request is filled, you'll get an email notification. For article requests, you'll have 30 days to log in to Doc Express and download the PDF. Make sure to retrieve your article during the 30-day period to avoid duplicate request fees. You can find more information about Doc Express on our services page. Please reach out to the Doc Express team using the Contact Us form if you have any questions. Now you can start using Doc Express to get quick, easy, and free access to materials that are not available in our library collections.